Sorry guys. So um, I'm still trying to get the gist of this fucking laptop. Um, somebody was juggling you guys. And I feel like the reason why this person was juggling you is because maybe there was some type of weight or a situation where this person couldn't, you know, do what they wanted to do. So they chose to go somewhere else. Yeah. And it could be someone that they were working with, but I feel like you found out about the situation and you ended it. Yeah, this person was being very manipulating and they also were being very cold and detached towards you while they were doing it. Not really a good energy, you know, but I feel like you guys are very sad about it because, again, you spent a lot of time, you know, investing yourself with this person, into this person for things to work out the way they did. But I feel like you guys have your guards up now. You're realizing that this shit was fucked up and you don't need to be here anymore. I keep hearing that song, Pack Light. So, um, I forgot, what's the name of that song? I forgot the name of that song. That's a new song by Queen Nodge, I think her name is. I think it's called Pack Light. But so, let's look into this. Let's see how this person feels about you. Spirit, please tell me how this person feels about Gemini. How does this person feel about Gemini? Spirit, please tell me how this person feels about Gemini. So, this person is like, you're not speaking to them. You know the truth. They know that you're probably indecisive about speaking to them. Um, it seems to me like it's been stagnant between you two. This person is a player. They're going to continue to do what they're doing or what they did. Yeah, I feel like they're... But the crazy thing is, this person is not done with you. They're, this person is toxically binded to you. And the crazy thing is, I feel like you're letting go. This person is not. You think they are, or maybe this person is giving you time to calm down. They're not done. I feel like there's a lot of conflict surrounded by whatever this person did to you. They're coming back, though. They're going to keep trying to come back. I don't know what this... What is the situation? The devil in the Knight of Cups. Why, why can't this person let my Geminis go? Ten of Swords. Three of Wands. Ten of Cups. Maybe they are. Um, ten of Swords, Three of Wands. Um, letting something in completely, turning their back to go towards the Ten of Cups. Okay, let's just clarify this Ten of Cups. Three of Cups, Three of Pentacles. Yeah, they may be going to work on the third party situation. So they will be leaving you alone for now. I feel like they're going back to somebody to work on things. Let's see how that'll turn out. Four of Pentacles. This person's going to be holding back. Three of Swords. There's a lot of heartbreak surrounding their situation. Okay, but I feel like this person may try to work out things with them. Yeah. Yep. It's going to end. It's going to end, though. Yeah. Too, this, your person is too controlling. This person that's dealing with your person is realizing that they're too controlling. Mmm. I see it could be an Aquarius, but I see a lot of back and forth things going on between them two. But they have their own cycle to deal with. And Gemini, I wouldn't be, you know, in the middle of that shit. Well, you're not going to be. I see you closing off and this person is just taking that L and going on to, you know, the next or the past, whoever. All right. So let's get some advice. Advice from my Geminis, please. I feel like there's happiness right around the corner. But I feel like you needed to experience this uh, burden so that you can let it go. Because I feel like you were very indecisive. You weren't willing to notice the truth, to see the truth, to accept the truth that this person just was not doing anything for you. They were keeping you stuck for their own fulfillment. Okay? Yeah. Now you can be happy. I see something very fruitful coming in. Look at this. Ace of Pentacles. I see something very fruitful coming in for you, Geminis. So you get a blessing. After you go through such a pain, whatever you feel like a loss is, Spirit says, okay, 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 let me kiss your boo-boo. And you get this, this brand new opportunity while your person still goes through turmoil in their, their relationship that they're in now. Okay, your Rebel Deck card says, stop, st stop texting stop talking stop checking 
on that person. Just fucking stop. <laughs> it says, spend time on someone worth it. Don't waste your time on ridiculousness. Well, they said what they said. All right, guys. Thank you.